I'm making this video because some guy named Regret would like to know what Minecraft is all about. Someone has already said that Minecraft is for people who liked Lego as a child and never really grew up. I think that is uh, quite accurate. I started, I started over here. These holes in the mountain weren't uh, weren't there any before, uh, mostly because of uh, creepers exploding right as I spawned, and it got larger and larger, and so I actually decided to mine in there. Anyway, um, my start point is like right here, and on my first day I carved a little bit out of this wall here and got lots of dirt and I made this pathway, this bridge across the water and I made a house right here as you can see I find that building a house on the water is the safest thing to do on the first day here I had a little boo-boo with the water oops so then I built on top of the dirt to demonstrate my opulence. I built it entirely out of wood. <coughs> um, so this this is my first house here. I have a chest with nothing in it and a workbench there. I don't really come here very often anymore. Uh, let us say, uh, as long as you have torches, uh, keeping the place is sort of illuminated like this you are... you prevent monsters from spawning there. Which is why I uh, developed kind of a uh, compulsive tendency to place torches everywhere I possibly can. Up here, I have a little lookout place for... well, serves no purpose at all except to be pretty. Anyway, then I go up here a bit more, and I have another lookout place. It's, again, I kind of did that a lot. Um, not really a reason for it. Good reason. Over at this end, I have, uh, well, not really anything. Uh, it's just sort of a way to get up to the track if I'm all the way over there. As you can see, this area over here is quite nicely illuminated because I don't like things appearing from out of nowhere. This is a portal to the nether, which is where you go to die. This is my uh, stove, furnace, whatever area. I covered it with stone just because it looks so cool. This is my main house. It's full and full of these uh, chests because chests are awesome. See, this is my chest for raw materials and stuff. Got lots of feathers and iron and wood and redstone and even some obsidian stored there. Silk or string, whatever. <coughs> Over here I have some tools I've made. Here I have lots more tools. Here are uh, here's some gravel and sand. Here is my dirt stash. Uh, there's some... Um, oh, okay, see, so here's the stuff I usually bring with me. Here's where I keep wood and products of wood and saddles and buckets. It's sort of a everything else bin. This is where I keep meat. This is where I keep all of my military supplies, although there's nothing really to kill. Over here, I have my stash of cobblestone and stone and stone paraphernalia. This is where I keep my nether rock. Nether rack, apparently. Uh, here's where I keep my overflow of pork and bread. Here's where I keep my bread. That's, that's all I'm going to say about this. It's really not that exciting. I made this passageway, well, I basically I built my whole house on top of a mountain that looked like a, it started out looking like a fortress, so I thought I should build on top of it, and it 
turned out pretty good. But there was no way to get up there if I didn't want to take the stairs on the front, which at first was a big problem because there was often monsters up there. So I made this another way to get up. Uh, in the bottom here I have a pit of death. I have my hunting area kind of. Oh, careful. There, skeleton. He cannot see me through glass. He's just a skeleton. Um, yeah, so this is sort of like a battlement area. Up here is my emergency escape route in case the uh, glass Oh. Check ass. In case the glass gets broken. I don't believe this. In case the glass down there gets broken. Oh yeah, there's my house, as you can see. This is all mostly natural. It's just formed like that. <coughs> what I've done down here is I've made some fire pits, which they oh. just have an obsession with accidentally jumping into. Uh, yeah, so... Fire pits are kind of dual purpose. Uh, well, the one purpose is to kill, so it's really single purpose. But uh, during the day, um, cows and various animals will haplessly jump into them and then die. And then I collect their goodies, and uh, that's how I, I get a lot of my raw materials. But at the same time, it also really helps to weaken skeletons and uh, spiders, especially. Out here I have a nicely illuminated lawn. Um, can you guess what happened here? Bloody creepers. This is the Pit of Doom. Um, it's sort of an air moat, I call it. Here is my super secure door. Can't get in unless you push the switch. Awesome. So this is another uh, entrance to my main house, but it also goes down into a mining area. Uh, torches everywhere. Torches are pretty good. This is where I do the most of my digging down here. Really, really deep. But I found some diamond down there, so it was worth it. <coughs> show you how this leads up to my main house again. Just gotta come over here a little bit. Right there. There's some lava in there. Really exciting. This was once a dungeon. Uh, I accidentally dug right into it while I was making my pit of doom here. And this door leads out to the bottom of my pit of death where I collect the spoils of anything that should happen to fall except chickens uh, so you already know it's out there, it's my, my battlement uh, up here is the stairs to go up to my house yeah, so that's pretty much what Minecraft is about it's about mining and crafting and killing pigs. No pig. Oh, good. These fire pits are made by putting a piece of wood, or nether stone as I understand it, in the middle, and surrounding it with uh, rock or anything else really. Uh, and then lighting it on fire. Sometimes it doesn't work, it just sort of burns down, but uh, usually after you do it two or three times it'll work. So that's pretty much all I've done, aside from just, you know, stuff that's not really too out of the ordinary, like I have another mine over there and there, and one way over there, and I went on a boat trip way, 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 way over there. So that is what Minecraft is about. Uh, it is 
basically just a free-form creativity game. You can do just about anything you want, uh, you know, within reason. Obviously, there's no such thing as physics here. Um, it's sort of like Gary's Mod combined with Lego, combined with Dwarf Fortress, uh, with an interface that doesn't make your eyes bleed. Oh, yeah, my roof. I forgot to show you my roof. This is my roof. I have torches up here due to an incident involving a spider in my house. It came through here. It surprised me. I will not allow that to happen again. Here I have a stash of cobblestone and dirt and opulence. But this also gives me a very nice look out. Oh, the nether. The nether. It's such a such a nice place. It's it's such a nice place, really. I, I think I'll just leave all my valuables here while I go there, actually. The nether is like an alternate dimension uh, that was added in the Halloween update. It is a non-denominational alternate dimension, however. It is not hell. It is the nether. Trying not to die here is sometimes tricky, especially when you're an idiot and you make your portal up high like this, which is tantamount to suicide. Because of these fun little guys over here. here. 